What is up, YouTube? Kev PJ here, man. Back at it with another reaction, and we're gonna continue with the Jasmine red flag video. There's a part three and part four now. We can watch. We reacted to part one and part two. Go watch that if you haven't already. Uh, before we start, though, I had a few comments from the last video. They actually told me some key information, so thank you. I appreciate that. Um, this guy said that skit was a prank, but it turned out to be true. So I'm guessing that was when Mama Rug um, was kind of going off at Jasmine. Apparently, that was a skit. And then another guy said this about how... I'll just put it up on the screen so you can read it. I'm going to read all of it. But yeah, thank you for commenting that. Appreciate it. But um, yeah, let's get into this part three. Is it just me or do you love stressing out your boyfriend? I just find so much joy in stressing out Brandon. I think I'm also going to get this See, like, trophy. The best parent. See, like, that's just... You should never say that. Like, whether you're a man or a woman. You should never ever say stuff like that man like it's not even funny like i don't know if she's joking or not but i'm gonna take it seriously and if she's being for real bro like imagine saying oh i love stressing out my partner imagine hearing that that's some toxic behavior man you don't want to be doing that because one day we will be the best parents i'm pregnant you're pregnant yes. yes but now we just need to go to the doctor and make sure that the baby is even yours what What'd you say? You only do that type of test if there's another man in question. There's another man in the picture. Hey. You've been with me every single day for seven months, laying in this bed, sleeping next to me. What do you mean another man? I'm not fucking with any other females. Why are you talking to other it guys? It's just a joke. It's a prank. No, you are Bro, you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? The fact that she's saying it as a joke, but it's actually true, bro. The fact that it's actually true but she's making jokes about it it's crazy and he, he had no idea bro that's cool i'm not the father oh well, that's what happens when you leave me bored in your house when you go to the gym you act like i went to go link up with another girl and that's why you had to prank me bam i went to go exercise i don't deserve this i'm too good to you i can't wait to see his kids well you're gonna, gonna see them in a couple yeah, hold months on, yeah. hold on but i said something oh yeah you want to feel the baby jasmine said we just have to go to the doctor to make sure i'm the father <laughs> what like well no i thought i was but earlier i don't know why but she told me I don't know, like, you know how she, like... All the boyfriends out there watching this video, how many... Babe, why did you walk out the store with the numbers 21? I'm not 21, I'm turning 28, bro. I already got us tickets to Hawaii. Oh, no, my God, we're going to Hawaii! <laughs> we're going... Oh, my God, I love you guys. You're honestly the best thing that's ever happened to me, and I'm so grateful. I'm blessed to have you in my life. Oh, my God, I'm so excited to spend the future with you and it's crazy because you really are everything i've ever prayed for and wanted in my life we saw this in the last video people think that you have never met jasmine I know. bro what and they always say can we get a video of rug meeting Just jasmine because not everything's on camera Doesn't exactly really you know jasmine always tells me she's like i wish dennis was back here so we could take you off my hand since i've met you I really push like a lot of my friends to the side and I don't go out with them ever. So if you're on a girl's trip and you're around a bunch of single girls who are getting drunk, smoking, whatever the hell you guys do on your girl's trip and they're, oh, I'm gonna go talk to this guy. Oh, that guy's cute. I wonder if he'll come look at me. So if you, even if you're a loyal woman, which I know you are, even if you're a girl who's in a relationship. I put you first. You're my number one priority. And you're my number one priority, yeah? You're my number one priority, yeah? Meanwhile, meanwhile, she'd be going to some uh, her ex's house at like 3 a.m. or something, lying to him, going like, mm, 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 mm. oh yeah, oh yeah. That's what she'd be doing. <laughs> Bro, it's just cook, man. It's been like that for an entire year now, and I think this is a good year. We need to spend like a lot less time together. This year, I really want to like focus more on like doing my own thing and not focus more on going with my ex that's what she's trying to say do my own thing translates to going with my ex bro 
not being together all the time. I want you to miss me more too. At home, I can't be there to protect you. So it's not about, oh, I don't want you to go to the club because you're going to cheat on me or because I don't believe you're loyal. It's about your own safety, especially if it's a group of girls, you guys are all drunk. Like you, you're- I'm going to be single in 2024 without Wait, you. You wanted to prank me and get me mad? Yeah. You, you think I got mad? I want to go on like a girl's trip. I wouldn't want my girl to go out and get drunk with her single girlfriends at the club, downtown, at a house party, or none of that. The way my beliefs say me and Jasmine are going to our first ever Phoenix Suns game together. together. My first ever he took her to a Suns game? He took this trash, trashy garbage can to a Suns game. He really gave everything. How? Man, I'm, I'm free, bro. Someone... Bro, I'm gonna spaz him out, bro. Sun's game, basketball game. You have a jersey? Follow my, my size? Follow That's me a red to my flag. closet. Follow Why do you have a jersey my size? Huh? Why do you have a jersey my size? That's a red flag. No, nah, it's because I, I. Is it burning your body to put Devin Booker on your back? Yeah, because I'm just like so sweet and nice that I don't want to wear like another guy's like name. Oh, huh? Yo! Ain't no way she just said that, bro. Bro, I'm, I'm actually gonna walk out, bro. Bro, she's saying this stuff while literally going behind his back and doing the naughty, bro. That's crazy. That's crazy. Honey, you have my permission when it's Devin Booker. It's no, okay. No, I just, it doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel right. You know what else doesn't feel right? Banging my ex behind my current partner's eyes, man. That's what she be doing. Um, I get to be the passenger princess today and just sit back, relax. You've never been to a basketball game? No, never. First time? First time ever, and I'm so excited. Hold on, hold on. She also said she didn't know him, but she saw Faze Rugg and Brawardis at the Austin McRoom basketball event. She was there cheering, and she was with an ex. <gasps> She's for the streets. She's for the streets. She's for the streets. Oh, she's for the streets. Make some noise for the Ace Family one time. Oh. Oh this is the Suns fan with, the, with the cutest girl here. Hey, well. Bro, how is no one fat? Bro. How... Hey, welcome to the Jasmine Moros and Edgar Delgado's YouTube channel. We're just a couple wanting to capture. What? <laughs> That's crazy. What? This is the Suns fan with the, with the cutest girl here. So that's how oh. we roll. Thank you, Bob. Appreciate that's that. How we your name five players. A Kogi? Yeah. Damn, five that's actually three. kind of a deep pull. Today, I'm going to be pranking my girlfriend with the classic breakup prank. But now that like, you feel the same, like I actually feel relieved. I'm not trying to accuse you of anything, but um, you're being a little manipulative. Look in the mirror and instead of calling me toxic, be like, damn, I just flirted with another man in front I of my boyfriend. I wasn't flirting though. In, like, in front of my boyfriend. You're being psycho. And She's being crazy. No, I'm not being crazy. All you gentlemen out there, if you catch your lady flirting with another man, you are psycho. You're the psycho one. Just remember that, guys. <laughs> Just like well, the reason I think it was on good terms is because like nobody caught one another cheating. Nobody caught one another lying. Yeah. So the trust wasn't broken. We were so like, I guess you could say still in love and mm -hmm. we still wanted like just a piece of each other that even we miss this person. We love this person. We want to be with this person. We see a future with this person. So like, let's work things. Brandon, I realized too, in this little bit of time apart that I miss you and I don't want to be with anybody else. Guys, I really did think it was over. So like I was sad. I was going through depression. I was like not leaving my bed. So it's like sad. Like he's the person that I did everything with. Wait, I don't want to cry. <laughs> don't cry. Bro, what don't is cry. This toxic manipulation ass thing that I'm watching, bro? Like seriously, bro. It's just crazy to me that people can be like this. And like you have no idea what's going on. Good. We're, we're good. Just give up on each but other. But I don't want that to happen. Cause like I do want to be with you and I want this to work. 
because our feelings are like very strong towards each other and we cannot stay away from each other and we love each other very much waiting don't touch me right now <laughs> I was like, as long as there was no cheating involved, lying to each other's faces, you know, the trust wasn't broken. Tell him, like, how you didn't, like, care about the YouTube channel. Like, you didn't care. After the first breakup, I literally told him, I do not want to be on YouTube with you. I do not want to film with you. I don't want to be on anything. But none of his family helps him with videos. So, of course, I had to be there to help him. Put myself on the line, taking all the hate for him to get a check, for him to get paid. I booked us a fly. He literally gave you a place to live gave you food gave you money i mean in the last video there were dms of her asking for like a 100 bucks for petrol money he gave you everything you had everything and you're complaining but those are the worst types of people ungrateful ungrateful people are the worst types of people to be around i'm telling you bro she had everything given to her by bro orders and still complaining ungrateful a hotel we're going to cabo you promise. You want? <laughs> oh my god, I love you. I already got us tickets to Hawaii. Oh, no, my god, we're going to Hawaii. We're going to Hawaii. Oh my god, I love you. But, man, I don't really know what the situation, like, is going on right now. Guessing... Because bro, I, I saw bro, this is still uploading like as normal. He's uploading as normal, but so he must be trying to just like, you know, um, kind of get this whole situation out of his head. But um, there you go, man. Jasmine's red flags. That, and this was the final part. I mean, you can just tell that she's one of those girls. Toxic, manipulative, red flags. Very, you know, clout chaser type vibes. So, and I feel like as a big, you know, YouTuber or creator or maybe like an athlete, um, celebrity, it would be so hard to find a loyal girl, a girl who actually likes you for you. You know, that's what fame does, bro. If you get famous, it comes with so much. It comes with a lot of hurdles. Obviously, it's probably a good life and everything, but in terms of your relationships and women, it's going to be extremely hard to find someone who really just likes you for you. That's why, man, my, in my opinion, find someone young. Because that way, they're with you at your lowest. Anyway, man, thanks for watching the video, guys. Appreciate it. Let's hit that subscribe button. We're almost at 1K, man. It's a 1K. It's a 1K, man. Hit it. Let's go. Umida umami. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. Cody, don't polo, bro. I'm just tripping, bro. Man. I love Don Polo, though. Don Polo's lit, bro. He, he's inspiration to me for real, man. Mi gente para bellas tiempo en pasemo. Y que quiera que se tempo. Que te le mi perfil.